Here are the particles Dr. Pym promised. Good luck, Iron Man. Thanks. I'm, uh, gonna need it. So what exactly is this Starboost thing? Meet me in the tech lab, kid, and see for yourself. Good luck, Tony. Thanks, Nat. You got one hell of a mission ahead, Tony. Only one anxiety attack confident. Pretty sure everything's tuned to perfection. Uh, pretty sure? Sorry, that came out wrong. What I meant to say is, everything's gonna be fine. Thanks for worrying, Nat. believe we're doing this. Thanks for reviewing those schematics, by the way. Yeah, my pleasure. Would hate to see you go up in smoke. If I do, I'll try to blow up out of sight and off the comms. Stay safe, Tony. Wanna go do some good? Good work. Keep this up and I might start sleeping again. <laughs> Every test I did before ended badly. But with this new miniaturized accelerator, I have a shot. Because it is awesome. $1.4 billion vanity project. I may incinerate on takeoff, but I'll look damn good doing it. All systems are in the green, sir. But I must warn you, a large storm system has moved into your direct flight path. Never rains, but it pours. Well, we can't wait any longer. Tony, I loaded up some music to give you a little boost. Oh, no. Don't worry, it's not mine. You can do this. Thanks, kid. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's go. 
override my system. Come on! Jarvis, you're still there! Guys, my system's starting to short out! Jarvis! Come on up! Jarvis, I'm on fire! A jet booster! Gotta do it manually! Juice left in these repulsors. Hopefully, this place isn't crawling with guards. Okay, let's see what we got. Wait a minute. Well, this doesn't make sense. Regenerative formula. That'll explain Tarleton's giant head. That's its source. Probably some unfortunate inhuman. Okay, let's find that door. No sweat. Rescue that inhuman. No more regen formula, no more adaptoids. High fives all around. Is up. Just a little hack through this next door without waking anybody up.
Unauthorized life form detected. Oh, hey. You mean me. If that didn't wake up the Robo Guards, I'm not sure anything will. Crashing through their airlock didn't wake up the robot guard dogs. Maybe they're here to keep something in, not out. Most of the power in this place is being diverted to that single room. Bingo. That's not ominous at all. You're alive. Tony. What are you... What is all this stuff? Where am I? No. Yes. Tony? Are you hugging me? What? No. I just didn't want you to fall. Then why aren't you letting go? I just... We thought... I mean, I thought that... Good to have you back, Captain. I'm so confused. Yeah, come on. Gotta get you out of here. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Tarleton. Did he survive? Tarleton? Who cares? What? The explosion, he was too close. He survived. Thanks to you, apparently. And Monica, if you believe the news stories. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> okay, I got you. The evacuation. All those people. Yeah, we'll get to that. You think you can walk? Yeah, it's okay. I'm good. Let's do this. Well, there's the cap I remember. Come on. Okay. What's the plan? Uh, well, we find an escape pod and, uh, escape. You're winging this, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Actually, didn't think I'd make it this far. Tony, where is everyone? Where's here? Oh, well, we're in space. My god. You weren't kidding. Nope. You sure you can do this, Cap? <laughs> I'm fine. I'm just out of practice. a bike, I guess. It's down from here. You ready to jump? Tony. What? What's happening? Well, it's a long story.
How long was I? Ah, well, five years. Which, by your standards, is just a power now. Starting to think people just prefer me on ice. See? You're already making jokes. The corny ones. But that's normal for you. just yet. Monica, long time no see. Can't imagine your buddy Tarleton was too thrilled about using superhero blood to replace superheroes. He leaves the details to me. Stop what you're doing. Now. Wait a minute. Georgie doesn't know about any of this. And he never will. Self-destruct beacon initiated. Uh-oh. I think we made her mad. Tony! I'm working on it! All right, got it. Let's go. What the hell? Oh, don't mind the killer robots. Hurry! Get it open! I'm trying! For a dead guy, you're really pushy. I'm gonna have to brute force this thing. Why didn't you start with that? That glass cap, it can't hold your weight! is we're not gonna die in a fiery ball of death. And the bad news? We'll uh, most likely suffocate first. <sighs> well, at least it's a good view. That it is. Damn it. So close. <sighs> well, since we're gonna die anyway, you have any, I don't know, last confessions? 
Your jokes. I just don't get them. I know, I read your diary. <laughs> Why'd you smash the reactor cap? A lot of people died. Tony, there was something buried deep beneath the bay. Somehow linked to the reactor, working its way to the surface every minute. It's the earthquake. I had to do something. The entire San Andreas Fault was about to blow. The ocean would have consumed the city. Millions would have died. Never doubted you for a second. Just had to hear it, you know? What the hell is that? Well, look who it is. Am I always going to save the day? I expect nothing less from the God of Thunder. Hi, Thor. Welcome back, Captain. This was your regenerative formula. George? How long have I been your lab rat? I knew you'd react like this. You'd rather die than need something from them. I trusted you. You saved your life. You can control machines with your mind. Just think of you all You infected me with his blood. It could have killed me. But it didn't. Remember the dream, George. How could you make me one of them? I made you strong. You stole my hope. And now... I am going to give you the same odds that I had. <laughs> I will rip the Earth of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. They had you. This isn't on you. Tarleton didn't even know Monica had me. What? Mayday. The heist. Monica hired Taskmaster to steal a Terrigen crystal. His men triggered the security protocols, initiating the Chimera's autopilot. But, <sighs> but that thing in the bay, that was unexpected. The heat signal. It must have been what caused the earthquake that took down the city. What was that? I don't know. Nat, I... I just keep thinking. If I hadn't... All those people... No. This is not your fault. That ship was never supposed to be in the air. I would have done the same thing. You're alive. I knew it! I'm sorry. Um, come on. You should really see this. Well, 
Welcome back, Captain Rogers. I know I speak for everyone when I say that you are a sight for sore eyes. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to be back. Since the Chimera's near crash into Manhattan, the situation has become dire. I fear AIM will use this as an opportunity to ramp up their persecution of all the Inhumans. We can't let that happen. The world needs the Avengers now more than ever. We are preparing for our final confrontation with AIM. I have completed my analysis of Mr. Stark's plans to equip the Avengers for this anticipated confrontation, and will need some special materials to complete them. Thanks, Jarvis. Time for us to get back in fighting form. Let's see what we need. Excellent, sir. As part of the effort, we might want to help our allies. Commander Hill and Dr. Pym are both reporting serious difficulty in coordinating our efforts due to AIM's draconian control over world communication networks. How can we help? They have requested we destroy AIM's main communication hub to help unite the Resistance efforts. Let's oblige them, old friend. Speaking of the media, reports of our own Thor Odinson working with ex-AIM scientists in a remote part of Scandinavia have started cropping up on the news. This may be part of AIM's propaganda campaign against the Avengers, but it bears investigation. Agreed. Let's get Thor on this ASAP. Great to see the old girl in the air again. Looks like the cavalry is here. I knew we could count on you. Excellent. Thank you. as clean and soothing as it always was. Hope we can find out more about Terrigen. I got a feeling we've only just cracked the surface. Bruce? How you been holding up? It was, uh, pretty touch and go there for a while. Kamala really helped pull me out of a tailspin. I'm looking forward to getting to know her more. She's a good one, Cap. Maybe one of the best. Welcome home, Cap. Glad to be here, Bruce. Good to be home again. Nat, I gotta say, I wasn't surprised you never gave up fighting. Didn't happen without a few stumbles. I almost lost my way like the others. Well, you're here now. I feel better knowing you've got our backs. You know, I always thought your suit was a little over the top, but I have to admit, you make it work. Thanks, Nat. Quite the rescue, huh? Now that you're back in action, old Georgie boy's probably losing his mind. He's going to be unpredictable. We need to be ready for anything. How did you guys pull it together after so many years? Honestly, I can thank Kamala. She believed in us, even when we didn't believe in ourselves. Well, she must be something. You and Bruce can be pretty stubborn.
Hi, um, Captain America? Wow, okay. I never, ever thought I'd actually get to work with you. Can I say that again? <laughs> well, I'm just a regular Joe from Brooklyn. Oh, uh, right. <laughs> just a regular Captain America. <laughs> I wanted to say thanks. Uh, what for? Well, sounds to me like you're the reason the Avengers are back. And that I'm standing here right now, so... So I wanted to thank you for that. Sure thing. I mean, happy to, um... Assemble the Avengers! <laughs> Anytime. So... You ready for this? Yeah. I, I mean, no. Sort of. That feeling... Never really goes away. You just have to trust yourself. And know we'll have your back when you need it. Thanks. Gotta get this installed. I'm a bit out of shape. You'd be proud of what S.H.I.E.L.D. has become. Wish you could be here to see it. Ah, my old encyclopedia set. I still can't get used to this internet thing. Ah, oh yeah. Much better than a cryopod. A bit older, but I don't know about wiser. Maybe I should ask Thor to help me decorate. I got a lot of catching up to do. No further information on the extraordinary meteor shower witnessed in the night skies over much of the Midwest early this morning. With the Avengers active again, many are understandably watching the sky with concern. But an astronomy expert from AIM has assured us that the phenomena like today's, while rare, are perfectly normal. And in this case, the public was free to, and I quote, enjoy the show. Oof. 
I gotta get this thing stocked with healthier options. Want a new look? I can help. Yes, you're able. The quiet before the storm. I expect this place will get pretty chaotic when we get to San Francisco. It would be good to fight by your side again, Captain. The feeling is mutual, buddy. The Avengers have been gone too long. you need nothing this time road trip to Vegas Bruce and I took a few years back really should have left the big guy at home time for us to live up to the symbol we've been gone too long This is where Monica gave up my location. What's her long game? 